Okay, hi, um, it's Sam, back at it. Um, I haven't made a video in about a year, and so to kind of like, I guess, prepare to like make another video, I watched my previous videos um, to like see basically what I already said. Um, and I don't know how I got views. Those videos were so bad. <laughs> you could definitely tell I like, had been in quarantine and hadn't talked to people in a long time but anyways so i guess thanks for watching them um but today i will be discussing how to make friends at franciscan and how that kind of process works because i've gotten a lot of questions about like what's the community life like there and like how how did i go about making friends like was it easy do i have to like insert myself into situations like that type of thing. Um, so I, um, first off, a few things have changed since my last video. Um, there's been new dorms. Uh, the Super 8 next to the school we converted into a dorm. Um, that's a good dorm. That's St. Agnes. Um, the Franciscan Inn across the street from our, uh, I don't know, our campus. Uh, one level was uh, for student housing just because we had a lot a lot of people this like fall semester this past fall semester um so we were kind of like you know put crap like i don't know looking for space i guess um so yeah a lot about franciscan changed this past year with covid um so it was a lot to adjust to just like what I was used to of being able to go visit other people in dorms, being able to go do my homework wherever I wanted to, um, you know, hang out with my guy friends, like basically on accident if I like run into them. Um, whereas like this past year, a lot of hanging out with people outside of your dorm had to be like very intentional. So, um, yeah. Uh, sorry, I got distracted. So yeah, today, um, how did I make friends? I came to Franciscan not knowing anybody. Um, I knew of people who had gone to Franciscan, like maybe one or two people, um, but I didn't actually know anybody going into it. So I, when I came to Franciscan, I was definitely an introvert um, coming out of it. I'm, I'm more of an extrovert than, than an introvert as of right now, I'm going into my senior year. Um, and the way that I went about going, like making friends, I like made it, made it a big goal for myself to like make about three friends every day. Um, and yeah, I'll go, I'll go into that later. But so my first friends were people that I was in a small group with. Like when you first get to Franciscan, um, people on your wing, you're put into a small group with them. And you guys just like talk every night and be like, hey, how's it going, blah, blah, blah. Also, this isn't a hickey. I just scratched my neck and I have really sensitive skin. So whatever. Um, but so those were my first friends that like I knew of were like those girls. And so like we went to like the orientation together. We went to like meals together and stuff like that. Um, but then there were a lot of um, like dances, different kind of parties that were on campus, like swing dancing or like um, food, like different volleyball games or like just a bunch of different stuff um, to meet a lot of different people. So Franciscan definitely like does a bunch of like community stuff the first few weeks of every semester to make sure that the freshmen like have people to like talk to and meet people and remember that like if you're a freshman coming into it and you don't know anybody there's a lot of other freshmen that don't know anybody either so like it's so easy to make friends like literally I would walk up to somebody sitting by themselves at lunch and be like hey I'm Sam like is anybody sitting here and be like oh no and I'd be like sweet can like I sit down and then I just sit and ask them about where they're from what are they majoring in like I don't know, what do they like to do? How was their summer? Blah, blah, blah. And so, like, I had a few, like, 
main talking points because like I get really nervous like when I walk up to people and just like try and talk to people it's gotten a lot better especially at Franciscan because like everyone's so nice um so like whenever I walk up to somebody and just like sit down like I've made a lot of my best friends that way like honestly um so my first friends were in my small group then I went to orientation and like met a few people that were like kind of on the outskirts and like I think we got like paired up for something randomly and so I made a few other friends that way and got their numbers and then they were kind of like my like trio group it was a girl and a boy and we like would you know go to you know eat together or like go to these different like conferences together blah blah um and then school started and that's when um, I started making a lot of a lot of friends just because with classes and stuff. So in my classes, especially if you're in like freshman classes, um, they'll go around like make you say their name, blah, like whatever. And like where you're from, what you like to do, interesting facts about you. Um, and so I would talk to people about the homework or like try like get their number or if they could like send me a picture of like this thing or try like oh could you help me with this like I don't understand it so a lot of good friendships were formed that way um I it was a theology class actually foundations of Catholicism um was where I met my friend group because I had about like five people in there that like I met and they ended up becoming my best friends um so yeah, I mean, for me, meeting people through classes was a lot easier um, than just like in the cafeteria or something. Um, but then again, like I had classes with a lot of people and would see them sitting by themselves in the calf and would be like, hey, like you're in, you know, my chemistry class or hey, you're in my philosophy class, right? And they'd be like, yeah. And I was like, sweet, like, can I sit here? I'm Sam, like, and then just ask them a bunch of questions. Um, I did that, I mean, just this past year, maybe the year before, I think, um, where I just saw a cute boy sitting by himself and I was like, doo, 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 hey, I'm Sam, you wanna come sit with me and my friends? And then like, we became good buds. Um, so yeah, I mean, it's, it's really easy to make friends at Franciscan. Um, I really, I wouldn't worry about it. My dad wanted me to join a household, like basically ASAP so that I could like have a good group of women, um, which is a, a good route to go if you wanna join your um, freshman year. Normally, I don't think you're allowed to join for most households um, freshman fall semester. Um, normally they make you wait until spring semester. Um, but I had a good friend group of about like 15 people that, you know, we would hang out all the time, do everything with each other. Um, so I didn't really need um, that. I didn't need a household for the friendships um, at the time. So um, yeah, it's, it's easy to make friends at Franciscan if you're willing to put yourself out there. There are um, people that, you know, are really shy and, um, you know, that's, that's understandable, but like, also understand that like, you're going to this college like for you and you're going to make as much of it as you want to. So I was like, you know what, screw it. Like I'm having this college experience because I want to, I'm going to make the friends that I want. I'm gonna be with the people that I wanna be with, um, the people that I enjoy being with and that push me to be a better person. So I did that and it, and it really turned out well. So that would be my advice um, for making friends this upcoming semester. Um, yeah, if you have any other questions, let me know in the comments. Uh, I might make another video tonight about where to go in Steubenville because a lot of people just don't know what to do when you're in Steubenville, especially if you're a freshman without a car. Uh, it's it's really tough so I'll make a video on that later so yay